Look at him. So self-assured. So smug. Ooh, I've got new hard drives. Ooh, I've got new hardware. Yeah, it's awesome. Is it awesome? I so what, what are we going to be doing? What's it? What's in the future of videos for BTP? Well, uh, consistency is a big thing. Uh, trying to have that programming, consistent programming right. every day. Uh, it's about three the, shows a day, yeah. actually. Keeping the Two quality three, up. At least. And uh, including as many antics as we can stomach. Antics. The antics do need to, because the antics are still happening. Yeah. You just, I'm just not recording them. It's all often. behind camera. Now, we've had some people request it's uh, right. HD for the video updates and low definition for the bat reps. But I, I'm faster. thinking HD for everything. That would be a lot slower. Right. But it's okay. Well, it's just a matter of working harder. <laughs> right? Uh, no. I it's mean, a, you and I are going to be putting in the hours. It's a matter of the computer. The computer goes. So, so you need another computer. Yeah. Like, wh what if we had a computer just for doing that? Just for rendering? Yeah. That would probably burn out one computer a year. Really? Yep. Okay. That's great. Well, everything's quantifiable. Really yeah, it'd look awesome. You know, I wonder what kind of banks they have down at Pixar. You know, <laughs> uh, there's all kinds of uh, stuff. yeah, crazy. Yeah, that would be awesome. All right, all right. Well, we'll, we'll see. So, does it need to be an apple then? Yeah. Because I noticed you have an apple, and I know, I know how self-righteous you guys yeah, that's are. That's all I'll use. It's really obnoxious. That's all you'll use. I'll use. A I PC see how you are. Builder. Right. But, okay. Yeah. There's no army builder for uh, for Mac. Mac? Uh, I'm pretty sure there's not. Well, how do you have it on your computer then? I don't use it on the Mac. I use it on the PC. Oh, that's the one you're gonna have at Valhalla then. Yeah. Oh, okay, great. Because I was wondering, well, how are you gonna use your thing? You have two, yep. two computers. Yep. Oh, wow. You're moving on up. That's great. Yeah. So yeah, we would need so we need another Mac basically yeah. per year. What do you think the cost of that would be? Uh, Eleven hundred dollars. Uh, Twelve hundred dollars. So twelve hundred. So about a hundred a month of burned out PC. Yeah. To you process. You buy a PC for hundred dollars right? a month and just right. kill it. Okay. Or you could buy one Mac. Right. Get what you pay for. We'll see. Well, but I don't understand. How does it burn it out? Just rendering. Well, it stuff. just renders it so often uh -huh. that yeah. uh, it, it's like running your car. 500,000 miles. Really? Is that a real thing? Yeah, because it, just it's seems always so, on. Yeah. Well, heat is what kills computers. Oh, okay. Right? So it's always on. It's always processing HD video with high quality sound at right. maximum speed, and that's all it does. Right. If we did, I don't know, two hours, of, if we did two hours of HD video a day, that's a lot of rent. I mean, that's right. easily 12 hours of rendering time. Could be 15 or 20. Really? So if it's all right, if it's just processing I'm ready. all the time, it'll die. Let's do it. Well, can't can't we just get it like a heavy duty fan, to keep it cool? We could put it in a meat locker. Yeah. That actually would help a lot. Does that work really? Yeah. For trulsies, but you're not talking about a meat locker. You're talking about actually a good yeah, fan. Yeah, like a freezer. Really? Yeah. Okay. You'd put it. You'd put it in there while it was doing its thing, right? Yeah, all right. This is this is all very interesting, <laughs> but I I'm down with it. Now, but the other thing I was thinking was maybe HD for everything is bad because some people have like slower upload speeds, so it'll make our content in it you know inaccessible. But YouTube automatically them. the first thing that it pulls up is yeah. 320p or something. It's oh, the lowest okay. resolution. So it'll allow you to, to run it at a lower resolution. Yeah, because that's what the processing speed or what it, why it's okay. processing for so long when we upload them. Right. Because it's got to convert it like three, Will four, people be able to see my nose hairs? I'll have to get one of those nose hair trimmers. <laughs> those things are gross. Start flossing. But, uh, yeah, you'd, you'd be... <laughs> do I have something in my teeth right now? Do you... Um, yeah, funny how when you get older, there's, there's new products that open up for you that become interesting all of a sudden. All right, well, before I go any further down that road... Hey, hey, Blue Table fans! All right, well, after all of that, time for your studio update. Again, uh, I'm still using a Yule Flip. 
until we can figure out the whole hardware slash mic situation. So that should be cracking up this coming week, and that's not a real phrase. So uh, I really don't have that much to show you. We've got uh, we got in these. These were sent in by a client to be painted. These are manticores. Uh, here's the missiles for one. So those are your two variants. You have the manticore with the four missiles, or you have a death strike, and so this thing will be attached like that. Really, really, really quite a handsome kit. It all goes on with the chimera, and so there's that. All right, we've got uh, the beginnings of a blue base-colored Grey Knights army, and here he goes. Watch the master at work. Look at him. He's, he's doing it just right. Mm -hmm. Here we've got a, an Ultramarines Storm Raven in mm -hmm. the works. Yeah. It's going to be really quite handsome. Blood Angels. It's all base coats today. So what's this guy? Why is he black? Flesh Terrors. Oh, that's what you're doing. You're doing black on the top. Okay, great. Thank you. Bork Dread. All right, we're working on a Doom of Malantai. Right. So what's this guy look like? Yeah, let's see. Wait, just a second. All right, there you go. I'm finished. Uh, let me see under. What do you have for the? Oh, the jaw's not on there. That's that's what I use for the jaw. All right, I can't show you all of the Tomb King's terrain. Here's a little preview slash. Before we move, I just want to get on record with these stairs. It's it's the little details of a place. There's 20 stairs here, and I, ca I go up them two at a time, and I count every time. I go two, four, six, eight, ten. And there's this. There's like a little thread missing. So, uh, yeah, I always compulsively go down on the left-hand side. And, uh, yeah, there's our steps. Let's look at them from the top. I'm going to miss this place. This uh, fairly depressing stairwell with brown, gross carpet in it. We also wanted to uh, say that we have our first t-shirt available for pre-order. It should be off of the printing presses in about seven days. It's actually being worked on right now. And uh, I'll provide a link for that. So support the cause, be a part, wear your BTP shirt. We're currently working on a second one. Uh, the first one is Hey Hey Blue Table Fans. I didn't pick that one. They just kind of just started designing it, and uh, which is great. I think it turned out okay. It just has my face on it. So, lest you think me overly egotistical, but actually you'd be right. And uh, then there's, um, we're doing a Lady Averages one, which uh, I think is, is really great. And that's the one I picked. I think that's the most interesting of them all. Uh, also, uh, exchange rates, so we do uh, ship overseas, and uh, so here's how it works. Um, let's say uh, our cost for something is $100, so, uh, and let's say the British pound is trading at $1.67, which I think is about where it is now. Uh, so what you do is take $100, you divide by 1.67, and you'd end up with a smaller number, which would be that in pounds. So um, uh, that would be something like, uh, you know, 65 British pounds. Um, and then you go the other way, like if you go on the Forge World site and something costs 100 British pounds, you'd multiply by that number by 1.67, and uh, you'd end up with $167 uh, dollars for 100 British pounds. That's kind of how you go about that. So, uh, but I, I'm always willing to do a rough uh, estimation if you don't know what the, it, how much things would be in your currency. Right now, it's just under two thirds of what it would be to do it in British pounds. So, anyway, there's that. And uh, yeah, it's been a little light, uh, but it's going to be a really fantastic uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, as you shall see because we are about to launch into a Warhammer Fantasy Valhalla up at Sundance. It's going to be spectacular. Tons of footage is going up of that. And um, But do not slow the rate of your inquiries. If you want a project done, let's set it up now. Let's set it up 
uh, over the next few days. I'm ready to go. I'm going to be keeping up on my emails like I always do. I'm very dedicated that way. Uh, I am currently right now caught up uh, uh, with communications, so by all means get in touch with me uh, to set something up. And if you're waiting on a response from me, then you should definitely get in touch with me again because obviously I'm under the impression that I'm caught up. So hope you enjoyed and got your inspiration for the day.